So first I wanted to talk about, so one of the reasons I had you on is because we are, uh, you know, the church, 242. Um, we've been meeting in your driveway. And, and what's the story of, like, how did you end up being a driveway church? Yeah. Well, it's not very funny, but it just, the pandemic hit. We were, we're, um, we we're about five years old. And okay. so we were meeting at a school. And when the pandemic hit, we got a call from the school and said, you're no longer allowed to meet here. And we just said, well, what are we going to do? Mm-hmm. You know, and we really felt like God didn't tell us to stop. So, so we're did gonna, you ever we're do gonna, just pure online church? Um, we did it for the two weeks that, the, you know, the mandatory shutdown. Yeah, yeah where and, everybody and is like wherever, hiding. Yeah, everybody's in a panic. We had, you know, the TP crisis of 2020 and, <laughs> like, you know, that that whole thing going on. And so we just, we sat back and, I, and you know, really in prayer. And I was just kind of like, God, what are we really supposed to do? Like, I don't want to kill anybody, mm-hmm. you know? And um, <clears throat> he just said, keep going. And I was like, where? And he's like, you got, you got a driveway, you got, you got a garage. So we changed our whole garage into like a sound studio and we just started filming from there. And then we, you know, let people be adults about everything. We said, listen, if you want to come, if you want to come, come, Mm -hmm. you have freedom to be part of this if you want or not want. And, um, we had the cops come come a couple times and just be like, what are you guys doing? Like church? (laughs) Okay. (laughs) <laughs> thanks for stopping by like you know like do you want to stay it i don't is, know yeah. what to do I mean, like, you can't miss it on the on the i mean so has it has it grown since you've done it you know what we have like um it's it, it's been growing uh our online's growing the people are showing up uh for easter we had over 200 people show up to my driveway <laughs> um it was they were parking like three blocks away trying yeah. to get to church and um <laughs> Uh, my neighbors are amazing because they haven't um, yelled at me yet, so that's, oh, that's good. Cool. Um, yeah, so we're in the process right now of trying to find a building because, um, A, we can't stay in our driveway forever, and mm-hmm. then, B, um, you can't rent any place. Mm-hmm. So yeah. the pandemic is still going, so they're like, well, how many people do you have? I'm like, we have like 200 people showing up, and they're like, yeah, we can't rent to you. So we're just kind of caught in that catch-22 right mm-hmm. now. And so we're just trying to uh, build up our funds to uh, go get a building. And uh, we have an opportunity. And so that's what we're doing. We're trying to, to raise up enough to uh, get that building. So Cool. Yeah. So And, and I, my understanding is the deadline is, is at the end of this month. The end of this month. So the, the people that own the property said that they would hold off um, all things until, well, pretty much they, they're going to wait to see what we can do. Uh, till the end of April. So I was really nice of them. Um, yeah. I mean, honestly, it was it was a blessing. So yeah, yeah. So this is a great property. So we'll see what happens. So. Cool. And we're close. We're close to raising that money. So uh, if close. anybody feels like helping, uh, throw some money in to help us get that building. Uh, there'll be a link in the show notes. I don't know if there's yeah. a short link that we can just say. I don't know if you go to church242.com. Yeah, you can go there. It says giving. You can click on that. Okay. So any, any giving to the church ends up going yeah. Do you there. want to take traditional fiat currency or do you take cryptocurrency and <laughs> That's uh, right, dude. precious metals? <laughs> For real. I'll take precious metals. I'm good okay. with that. Yeah, just get it. mail them. Just mail them to you. Bitcoin. <laughs> Dogecoin. Dogecoin. Now well, that's it. Man. Yeah. Goodness. Right. Was it ever weird in scaling having church in your driveway? Did you ever have like a... Yeah. I, mean, I don't know, because you have weirdos. Do you ever have weirdos show up? or All just, the time. I mean... I mean, you, you have police show He's up. Got two hundred weirdos. Showing yeah. up. <laughs> like, you come? What is that? <laughs> it's got to be scary. And I mean, yeah. His family yeah. came. They have this crazy. And they know kid. where you live. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I think that was the the biggest thing. Is like, well, everybody knows where you live now, so it's mm. like we're online. You can see people. Know, you know, even though when you're looking at it online, you can't tell how many people are there. Yeah. Um. So that kind of I think has saved us. I think if we if we pan back and you saw everybody, I'm sure we'd have people call. Well, it's on online us. now. So yeah. <laughs> I gave it Dan, happens. I gave Dan that video. Game with over 100 people yeah but uh you know almost no there's some people wearing masks people sit on the lawn if they want to mm-hmm. wear masks if you don't want to you don't have to and that's one thing i loved about it i mean it's just nice to see people smiling and sitting together and yeah. doing church and um so yeah it was a blessing so Cool. So if I show up in my triple mask and my face shield, will I be ostracized? Did you can come? You can come in a hazmat suit. I'm cool. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Does anybody ever walk by from not from the church? It's like put on your mask. I know. I have not have that yet. Mask up. I think there's because there's so many people there. I think they'd be like, ah, we're outnumbered. Let's just keep moving. <laughs> and there's a lot of older people that go and they're not wearing their masks. They're just like, I, I think. But the older people are the ones that are like pushing no mask. Yeah. They're yeah. Like, they're we hate these things. They're sick of it. Yeah. Yeah. Anyways. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 
Well, how many deaths have you had in the church? Zero. Thank <laughs> Jesus. Checking. It's a good thing that yeah, was zero. Zero <laughs> deaths. Matter of fact, yeah. Matter COVID of, related. Yeah, a lot of people from our church have had COVID, but mm-hmm. the reality, like, they never got it from us. Yeah. So, which is, they can trace it back to other So, you're other not a places. super spreader? No, we're not a super spreader. Thank God. <laughs> <laughs> so, we're doing our best to be, you know, like I said, yeah. guidelines and all that, but... People but are people. That, we have freedom in this country, so we're going to stay with that. So. Yeah. No, I, 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 when I got there, I loved it. I was like, this is what the church should be doing. You know? yeah. Just, I, mean, I wanted to support it. So now we're going to play the little game of sin or not sin. Oh, oh and then if you wanted to donate, there's we're going to have a link. Did we say that? Yeah, we have a link. Yeah, right. So yeah, there'll okay. be a link. Church42.com. 242.com. To make an offering to, for the new church's new construction. Please do. Please share. Yes. That's awesome. Uh, we got till the end of this month. I think we got pretty close. It's like you're trying to raise we're, like 400, yeah. 450 grand and we're like a 50 grand away or something yes, like that. Yes, we were trying to raise $450,000 in two months. And, <laughs> yeah. uh, it's crazy. And uh, we're $50,000 short right now. So, so if you're rich, if you are if you own a satire but, site, you're a CEO of a satire site. That's, yeah. You know, listen, possibly. Or, listen, if you're, or, or if you're Elon Musk. Or if you're a CEO of yeah, a rocket company. and Or CEO of Cats, Bobcat. <laughs> Way to bring it back, and that's good. <laughs> My name is Kyle Mann, and I'm the editor-in-chief of the Babylon Bee. Snopes, the fact-checking website, seems to think we deliberately trick people, and I'm here to set the record straight. We are fake news, so don't ever subscribe to the Babylon Bee. All right, we got it. Oh, please, Mr. Snopes, let me go. I don't deserve this. Whatever.